Good morning, and welcome to Awake in the Dawn. September 2nd, from everlasting to everlasting. After this time had passed, I, Nebuchadnezzar, looked up to heaven. My sanity returned, and I praised and worshipped the Most High, and honored the One who lives forever. His rule is everlasting, and His kingdom is eternal. Daniel chapter 4, verse 34. History books contain scores of chapters filled with stories of failed and fallen kings, kingdoms, emperors, empires, and nations. They are filled with countless pages containing people and places that once held broad influence, power, and prestige in the world. These forces were once thought to be so mighty, and their words were thought to be as invincible and impenetrable as their reputations. However, new conquerors and ideals rose, engulfed the old, and ignited a new cycle of power. And so it will continue as history unfolds until the earth itself experiences its final twilight. In today's scripture, we see Nebuchadnezzar look up into heaven to worship the Lord on high. We're reminded that only God himself holds an everlasting rule, and only his kingdom is permanent and eternal. God, Yahweh, lives, rules, abides from everlasting to everlasting. His kingdom has no twilight. There is no end. Glory, honor, and praise to you the only God, the Most High God. Amen. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Thank you again for joining me this morning for Awake in the Dawn. Please, I encourage you to go to awakenthedawn.com, take a look at the ministry tools that we have available for you.